Boop, boop, boop. Oh, hey there, Predator! Didn't expect to see you here! How you doing? You staying cool today? <laughs> oh, that's great to hear! I myself am not doing too good because Rain is going to come in and torture me! And then Scorpion's going to come in and melt all my snow cones! Ah, damn it, Raiden! I told you I don't want to be part of your stupid psychotherapy! I'm out of here! What happened to my Hellfire? Why can't I use my powers? Well, first off, you'd have to actually have powers to use them. Second, I can't use mine either. Raiden did something in this room. And whatever you do, yeah, don't true. touch them. <laughs> and don't touch the door. It shocks you. Ugh. You could have led with that, you assicle. What? You just seem like more of a hands-on type of learner. That's all. Well, I'm gonna go out on a limb and not try the window then. All right, he'll be here any minute. You remember the plan, right? Of course I do. We're gonna take Sega Genesis. We're gonna put Sega CD on it, a 32 X system on top, and then Sonic and Knuckles, then the Game Genie, then Sonic 3. And then we're gonna do a cheat code so the Genie actually comes to life, and then we'll wish Raiden away. No, what are you even talking about? The if we ever get forced into therapy again plan. I showed you pictures and diagrams for like an hour. Did you not pay attention? Okay, you severely underestimate my ability to drown out your whining on a regular basis. The plan is to act like we're not angry at each other anymore. That way it'll seem like we're cured, and then Raiden won't punish us. Oh, this is not gonna be easy. I would punch you in the face for using quotation figures just then. The point is, if we can convince Raiden that we're all better, maybe he'll move on to some of the other guys. You know, Baraka with his teething issues, and Smoke with his I can't seem to stop smoking thing? Yeah, and Reptile with his baby problem. What the hell is that about? In retrospect, Reptile really should have been the first in therapy. You know, now that you mention it, that kind of was a big oversight. Are you ready to do this? Let's get this over with. Wait, does it feel like the hairs are standing up on your arms? Raiden's coming! Oh. Fancy meeting you two here where I put you on purpose. We're about to begin. Please be seated now. Damn it. God damn it, Raiden! We don't need you and your Thunder Guide mental miracles anymore! We're cured! Ooh. You think so, huh? Yeah, we don't have any problems! We're all good now! Yeah! See? Well, of course, you don't think you have a problem. You're in denial. It appears you're still in stage one. We've got a lot of work to do. Wait, we mean it, Raiden! See, we, we get along just fine now! Look, look, it's my best bud! My best pal here! Yeah. Oh, yeah, see? Yeah, we're we're even holding best hands! Best. Okay, we, we what, what? No, don't touch me like that! Stop touching me! No, don't, 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 hey, stop! Physical don't contact. do that! Check! See, we're all good. Really? Because that looked like just about the cringiest thing I've ever seen in my life. And I am very old. But maybe you are cured. I am, after all, a very powerful god. And maybe my influence on you has cured you. But I have to be sure. Looks like we're gonna have to do some tests. Are you ready? Uh, yeah! Oh, See? Yeah, Happy about that, are. yeah. Bring it on! Absolutely! First. It's one thing to get along with one another. It is an entirely different thing to trust them. What I would have you do now is called a trust fall. It consists of two people, one who falls and the other who catches. If you are falling, you will stand facing away from the catcher, fold your arms in front of you, close your eyes, and fall. And the catcher okay, will speak. catch the fall. Understood? What? Somebody talking to me? You, I wasn't paying attention. Can you go back to paragraph three? I got it, Raiden. Yeah, yeah, me too. Of course. Of course you both got it. It just came to me. Okay. Let's do whatever we're going to do. Good. Scorpion, you will fall. Sub-Zero, you will catch. Assume the proper position, please. Ah. Uh, damn it. Can't wait to do this. Uh... Like, like that. Good. Now yeah. close your eyes, Scorpion. Scorpion, close your eyes. Close my head. Okay, I have two problems. We do a little scenario here. 
One, I have a Lynn Croy behind me and I'm supposed to close my eyes. That really runs me the wrong way. Two, how do I know he's not gonna form a giant icicle and shove it on my ass? What? Why would I ever do that? Why would you not do that? We all know your major fantasy is to shove a stick up Scorpion's ass, freeze him to make it an actual Scorpion popsicle. Ah. And I will not have that. That's where I draw the line. Raiden. I will not be a popsicle. For one, that is a very unusual fear. And two, your powers don't work in this room. You have nothing to worry about, Scorpion. Simply fall, and Sub-Zero will catch you. Okay, if you say so. What are you so worried about? I'll catch you! Come on! Alright, do it! Cross your arms and kiss. Rise, let go. Fall. I don't know! No. Now you were supposed to catch me! How could I? Why would you fall that way? Hey! Raiden said this was a test! Tests are supposed to be challenging! Why would he fall toward you, making the test easier? Right, Raiden? No, Scorpion. The idea is not to test the speed of the catcher. It is for the faller to put his unrestricted faith that the catcher will catch him. Do you understand? Uh, I knew that. I was testing him. He's very slow. Maybe we should move on to something less complicated. I will now have you both give me a list of three things that you actually like about each other. Okay, yeah, this yeah. is fun. Perfect. Cool. Can we, can we do this? Uh, uh, help. Sub Zero. We'll start with you. Damn it! I yes! Knew this would start Thank you! Uh, you know, I'm really loving this therapy session, Raiden, but I don't know if he can list three things. I don't even know if he can count that high. <laughs> Alright! He can count! Hi! Alright, well, one thing I like about Scorpion is how smart he makes me feel on a regular basis. I'm so glad I waited to finish ice school. Oh, and his non appearance in Mortal Kombat 3. And the fact that no matter how much he tries to kill me, I just keep getting stronger. Ha ha ha! Fine. Scorpion, it is your turn ah, to give me a list it. of three things you like about Sub-Zero. One, I like how he punches. As not to land me any damage whatsoever because they're so soft. And uh, two, I like how he sounds he's on fire. It always brings a smile to my face, brings joy to my heart. Uh, and I also like how after all these years of endless squabbling about trivial things such as color and temperature, how he has never yet truly abandoned me. Ah, oh, damn it, right? Right, shame on you! No, I hate you! Okay, so I hate good. you, and you can sit on Frosty's face. Don't rub it in. That's I don't, this is unnatural. I, I, this is a violation of man law number four. Okay, thou shalt not compliment another man. It is, it's, a, it's a violation face. against nature. I'm just gonna say- Ow! Ah, ah, ah. Ow. Scorpion, ah. calm down. You've made a breakthrough. It's a good thing. But I think we should move on. I have a special guest uh, waiting- Not okay. To dive into the very depths of your mind. It's a psychiatrist. Hello, patients. I'm Scarecrow. Raiden's new mental health consultant. <laughs> what? What's going on? Don't breathe! He'll make you naked! He'll do what? How do you even know this guy? Yeah, I don't, all I know is he releases green Febreze in the air, and you breathe it in, and you become naked, and then you throw water at me! It's awful, it's very upsetting. I don't believe it. Oh, Sub-Zero. I haven't quite had the pleasure of meeting you. Cover your nose! You Cover your mouth! You How do you do it? Stop! Stop! Know. Just get your hands yeah. off! Oh, you're on your own, Ned! I'm out of here! Tell me, what do you think of my new cologne? Wait, what's that? Ah! Well, this isn't so bad. It's pretty hot out, but at least I got a popsicle. I don't know what he was so worried about. Here we go. What? No! 
Oh no! Oh come on! There's gotta be a little bit left! There gotta be! There gotta be a little bit! Please! Just a little! Come on! No! Just get down here! And don't forget your hammer! It's a no! I got an idea! Oh my god! What happened? Oh, uh, hey! Oh, see, I warned you! I told you not to breathe! Your naked form is awful, isn't it? Isn't oh, it? No! I have an idea! An idea, okay? What, are you having stomach problems again? Like diarrhea? No, no! I, I, fuck you! An actual idea! Oh, yeah. I'm having an idea. Just, I got a plan, okay? We just gotta, we just gotta make it work. We gotta deal with this shit for a little while longer. Okay, then we gotta get rid of this guy. Oh! Don't mind if I do! Ah, in all my years, I've never, ever been treated so unprofessionally. I can tell when I'm not wanted, you'll be receiving my bill. Ta-ta now. I said good day, sir! Did you just use my spear? What do you want? I can't use ice right now. How do you like it? You like it? Was it balanced well? Is it, you know, is it good weight? Good, good length? You just want me to talk about how I touched your spear, you pervert. <laughs> no, no, yeah, yeah, I do. Now, Sub-Zero, we use our words in this room. Looks like you and I have bought ourselves an extra therapy session. That was a complete accident, I'm sorry. Oh, he's here. He's here. What? He's here. here? Wait, this isn't Comic-Con. You, Thunder God of Asgard. Mr. Avenger Guy, come complete with meat tenderizing tool. Son of Anthony Hopkins Gandalf. Take your Fabio haircut and get out of my realm. Oh, oh you're just angry you didn't make the cut. The Avengers already have a desk lamp. What did you do? Roll out of bed and take all the sheets with you? Oh, snap crackle. Fuck you. Hey, at least I'm not the one with a tablecloth wrapped around his neck. Triple H pre-2011. Oh no, he did it. Oh, he did! He did! You're making me so angry! Get the meat man out of my face! Get the meat man out of my face! Get the meat man out of my face! Don't you dare! Scorpion, it kind of looks like Raiden and Thor are having a little trouble with their relationship here! What? I think you're right, Sub-Zero. You know, it looks very unhealthy to me. Borderline violent behavior, in my opinion. I think we might need to give them a special therapy session that only we could provide. You're right! Go do it! Uh, no. Oh, hey! Don't mind if I do! Oh, yes! Yeah. Yeah. But it looks like we're gonna have to start our first session right, right now! Yeah.